Well, hello, my friends. Uh, my guest that was scheduled to be with me today, I uh, had to cancel, but hopefully they'll be with us tomorrow. So today I wanna just chat with you a moment. Uh, you can see uh, we're outside here, we're on a river here in Eastern North Carolina and the wind is blowing. And I was thinking about, you know, it'd be kind of scary to beat out there today in this rough weather. In fact, I've been out in water like this before. It's not very pleasant when you're in a boat. But I'm reminded of what Jesus said in Mark chapter 4. He told the disciples, says, let's go over to the other side of the Sea of Galilee. And on their way, a windstorm came up. Just, I just kind of imagined it'd be kind of like today. And it was really bad. And water coming in the boat. And Jesus is in the back of the boat sleeping. <laughs> and, they, you know, they said, Lord, don't you care about us? Get up. Can you imagine sleeping in a storm? You know, I've slept through a few storms before, but I think uh, with water flying in my face and everything, it'd probably wake me up. But Jesus slept right through it. They get up. Jesus stood up and he said, peace be still. Can you imagine something like this just immediately just being calm? Now, that's a miracle. <laughs> then Jesus said, why are you afraid? You have a little faith. Let me say, my friends, when you're in a storm, when the wind's blowing, the waves are coming over your bow, and you're struggling. I mean, you you don't know what to do. Jesus, that same Jesus that caused the weather to calm and the, the water to, to calm off, that same Jesus, he will give you peace. In the midst of your storm, whatever storm it may be, physically, emotionally, maybe socially, Whatever storm may be, Jesus wants you to have peace. He told his disciples, he said, my peace I give to you. Friends, I want to just tell you, in the midst of a chaotic world, we can have peace. We can be sleeping in the storm, just like Jesus. Well, God bless you. Hopefully my guests will be with us tomorrow.